Revenge is not always sweet. Sometimes it's twisted. And for that, you'll have to watch the much talked about film, Promising Young Woman. Every week, I go to a club. I act like I'm too drunk to stand. And every week, a nice guy comes over to see if I'm okay. You okay? You are so pretty. I am a nice guy. Are you? I should. Okay. How old am I? What are my hobbies? What's my name? Okay. <sighs> He's not Al. He's not Al. He's not Al. Please help not, us welcome really not. a very promising young man, Mr. Chris Lowell. Okay. <laughs> you hear the cheers? I hear the cheers. That was incredible. But the thing Thank is, you. I was ready to fight you, Chris. So I understand. Ready. Listen, I'm ready to fight me. I don't play the nicest character in this film. <sighs> Chris, like my, I should sue you and Emerald because, or everyone <laughs> involved. Let me tell you, like my jaw still hurts. It literally dislocated from my face to the ground, but it was I just the you. most. But for the but for, but I don't mind it being for this movie because it's all kinds of brilliant. Seriously, it so is. Yeah, yeah. E Emerald Fennel, who wrote the script, uh, did so many genre bending things with this movie. I I really do think ev you could watch every scene and however you think it's going to end, it's not what you expect. Um, she is constantly manipulating our expectations of where this movie is going, and that's what makes part of what makes it such an incredible uh, uh, movie to watch is that you just have no idea where it's going. Ever. Well, I I, ha I had no idea, but it was just like I can't complain. I'm not really like ugh, I was mad, but it, I'm, I'm, I'll get over it. I have to keep reminding myself, no, he is not this dude. He's playing a character because we have loved you like from day one. And I say we because you have your little fan club over here from Veronica Mars to Glow yes. to The Help. You have been a part of so many like female empowering stories. So that that's the reason I was like, you know what? I'm not going to fight him anymore. I'm going to be just I'm just going to love him, not fight him. You know? Well, I think what's interesting about this movie is there's a lot of, um, you know, nice guys that you've seen in the past. I mean, Adam Brody's in it, Chris Metz Platts, Max Greenfield, Sam Richardson. These are all really nice, good guys that we're used to thinking of as nice, good guys. And I think seeing them in this context really makes you challenge. It challenges your idea of what the nice guy is. And uh, Emerald really blows up that concept pretty incredibly in this movie. Oh, no, it's you, definitely you a were, conversation starter. Exactly, you are incredible. You're pretty much incredible in whatever you do. And let me just say, like you, I, and I feel like I'm not an actress. Hello, no one's gonna hire me to act. If they want to, tell them not to. By the way, <laughs> but you, you have been. I think you, you live like every actor's dream when it comes to like the range of acting. You know, characters that you get to take on, like Bash, seriously from Glow. I know. We're going to miss this. the show, but kudos for Bash even. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, you know, I think for me it's like uh, any opportunity to play a character that is... It, when in, Anytime I see a challenge, whether it's Bash on Glow or Al in Promising Young Woman, th that's what I get most excited about. When I read a script or read a scene and I get nervous about it or I don't know how the hell I'm supposed to pull it off, that that's usually when I know it's a, a, a role worth pursuing. And... Um, whether it was Glow or Promising Young Woman, those are two radically different and, and very mm -hmm. uh, difficult challenges that were really fun to take on. Okay, so you know I like I have a way of like tracking people down. So I tracked down your bosses to find a clip. They were like, no, we don't want to give the movie away. And it's I try to explain it like briefly to people without giving it away. How would you describe it to people without telling them like what goes down? It, it, the film or my character? The film, the Promising Young Woman, because that's what yeah, I so, like. Because uh, that's what you're here for. Sure, sure, sure. So Promising Young Woman, the idea of it is uh, Carrie Mulligan plays this girl Cassie, um, who ha is a promising young woman. She she's a, a, a promising doctor. She has a lot of career goals and ambitions, and she ends up sacrificing all of that. Uh, her life basically gets derailed as she seeks to. Um, get vengeance and right the wrongs of a disturbing thing that happened in her past. And um, it, it, it gets, it's sort of the further the film mm -hmm. progresses, the more unraveled she becomes. And I think more, the more unraveled the audience becomes watching her go down this path. It's crazy. No, it no, crazy, crazy is correct. Movie. You have no idea. Like, crazy is, like, all kinds of crazy. And I described yes. you as a promising young man earlier on when I introduced you. And, like, you keep, like, proving me right when I say that because you're also working um, on, um, on a new show, right, with Shonda Rhimes. 
Oh yeah, 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 yeah. It's yeah. Invent an uh, Anna. That's what I was thinking about. Anna. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was it, thinking. That was also. I got to shoot that in Morocco. We got to Ooh. shoot last year right before um, everything got shut Ooh. down. It was that's got Laverne Cox, who's actually also in Promising Young Woman. Um, and yeah, I mean that story, the Anna Delvey story, is also completely wild. If you know anything about her, she's especially a New York staple. I mean, this she basically this woman came in pretending to be an heiress of a fortune and swindled all of Soho's fanciest hotels and and elites to uh, basically just grift for like two years. It's, it's an amazing story. We cannot, and Shonda's going to tell it great. We cannot wait to see it, Chris. We cannot. Maybe we may or may not want to fight you after we see it. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Absolutely. Promising Young Woman is now available to own for the first time on digital, on Blu-ray and DVD, Tuesday, March 16th. You can also see it in theaters.